to more breaking news for you after pressure from county leaders and workers there. Shell has just paused construction of its new ethane cracker plant. Channel 11's Amy Marcinko had started reporting on this yesterday. Amy, a big change in just the last hour here. Well, that's true, David. Drastic changes. Less than an hour ago, we got an email from Shell that says as of tonight, it will be shutting down the plant, telling us the health and safety of its worker is the most important thing right now. And tomorrow, it will begin a deep cleaning of the facility. But I think the time has come, and someone needs to say what many people are thinking. The Shell Cracker plant must be temporarily suspended due to the involving COVID-19 pandemic. Strong words by a group of Beaver County leaders after being inundated by concerned residents and concerned shell cracker workers when it comes to the coronavirus, especially after seeing all these pictures. No toilet paper, no sanitizer, workers packed into buses just inches from each other. This is a huge construction site, almost 8,000 people from the tri-state area. And just hours after Beaver County put the pressure on shell, it shut down late Wednesday afternoon. No business regardless of size, is immune to the virus. The site shall not be granted some self unilateral exception from the controls our governor has put in place. These local leaders have no executive power, so they called the media, leaned on the governor to put pressure on the company. Shell cannot put our county and its residents at a countywide pandemic by continuing to have our dedicated men and women potentially exposed to this COVID-19 virus. Channel 11 started getting texts and emails from workers around 3.30 saying Wednesday is their last day that they have been temporarily furloughed. The workers we talked with glad to get off the site for the safety of themselves and their families. Shell is hearing us. I know Shell wants to be a good neighbor and wants to be responsible uh, to Beaver County. This is their home now too. They don't want to have an infection that outbreak any more than we do. We're all in agreement that there's the potential for a very catastrophic outbreak if something happens with 8,000 people coming in and out. And nothing like that has happened, but Shell again has closed its plant and we're told it will close down for the next seven days to do deep cleaning. We will continue to be in contact with them. And if any of that changes, we of course will pass it along to you. Reporting live, Amy Marcinkowitz, Channel 11 News.